Hey guys, so today I will show you one of my favorite hair masks for hair growth. And this is also a gentle exfoliation slash detox to get rid of dandruff. It also can make your hair softer and it promotes healthy scalp. And I call it my black pink hair mask. So the first ingredient we'll use is the pink Himalayan salt. And this helps to dissolve dandruff and product buildup on the scalp. It also helps stimulate blood circulation which improves scalp condition, thus it encourages healthy hair growth. It also promotes healthy hair follicles and it absorbs excess oil from the scalp and at the same time helps your scalp moisturize. Now the second ingredient is activated charcoal. Now this deeply cleanses your scalp and removes impurities that may be weighing your hair down. This can also make your hair feel lighter instantly. Now, there's an anecdotal evidence suggests that activated charcoal unclogs the hair follicles to promote hair growth. Thus, it is a popular hair care ingredient used in shampoos for its cleansing and detoxifying property. Now, the last ingredient that I'm gonna be adding in this is mayo. Now, mayonnaise is known to contain an amino acid called L-cysteine that plays an important role in improving the growth of your hair. Besides, the egg present in mayo is high in protein content, which helps to strengthen and thicken your hair follicles. It also has vitamins and fatty acids that in help keeping your hair softer, smoother, and shinier. So what I'll do here is of course, I will just combine these ingredients together in my little bowl right here. So the proportion can be adjusted to the amount of hair that you have. So feel free to add more or less of these ingredients. So approximately the proportion of the pink Himalayan salt and the activated charcoal should be 50-50 and then the amount of mayo is up to you. And also in here, I'm going to add in the rosemary oil because beyond its stimulating hair growth properties, rosemary essential oil is also used to prevent premature graying and dandruff. It may also help with dry and itchy scalp. So in there, I'll add in about two to three drops of it and then just mix it all in. So now you want to get this kind of consistency. It's pasty but also not too grainy and thick so that it'll be easier for you to apply on your scalp just because it can be drying on your hair and scalp if you don't put enough mayo in it. So for the application, I'm just gonna go ahead and apply this directly on my scalp, especially since I wanna detoxify that area and also use this for hair growth as well. And also I just want my scalp to be healthy. I'm also experiencing a little bit of dryness as well. It's probably because of the weather. And I'm specifically applying it on the parts of my hair and my scalp that needs it the most and also by the way you can use this all over your hair if your hair is oily or if your hair just needs some deep cleaning or clarifying and I also find that it's actually best to use after you oil your hair now from there you can let it stay on your hair for about 20 minutes max and then just wash it off with your shampoo and then this is the result my hair feels so much lighter and softer as you guys can see here now, sometimes excess oils or dirt on your hair can make your hair look dull, weighed down, and lifeless. So that's why I like it that whenever I use these kinds of hair masks, my hair just feels super clean and smooth after. And also, this is one of the exfoliating hair masks that does not dry out your hair and scalp. And it is also very gentle on the scalp, so it is great to use if your scalp is sensitive. Just make sure that you find the right proportion for your own hair type and scalp. So that's why you can tailor this according to your own hair type and the needs of your hair as of the moment. So that is it, you guys. If you like this video, please give this video a thumbs up. And if you found this content valuable, please do share it to a friend. And I will see you on my next one. Bye!